All right, guys. Hey, I'm back. My name is Alan Diaz, and uh, today what I want to do is I want to go over to you or uh, with you. What is a C61 licensed contractor? Well, uh, this is what's known as a limited specialty classification. So keep that in mind. Uh, now the CSLB calls these the D licenses, and some of you may not have ever heard of them. A lot of people they heard of the A license, you know, engineering. They heard of B, which is your general construction license, and then your specialty license like cabinets and all that kind of stuff, which fall in the C category. There is a C61, which has about 20 or so D classifications under that. Now the beautiful thing about this is this. Um, for example, look at demo. It's really construction cleanup and demo, but demo would be a D63. In other words, you would end up getting a C61, but the CSLB or the Contractor State Licensing School, they're going to recognize that as a D63. All of these D license contracting um, businesses would fall under the C61. So we also have your pool and spa. So if you want to get your pool and spa license so that you can um, do some repair work on those and take care of that spa that your, your wife's been bugging you to fill up again, um, you can get your D35. And that again would fall under your C61. Now there's something really incredible here uh, that I want to show you, uh, but real quick, you can also get tree trimming. Tree trimming is a D49. Paper hanging, you get tired of watching paint dry? Well that's okay, just cover it over with paper hanging. You have nothing to do, you can cut out your nice little things and start sticking it up. You know, when you have those kids and they come back with all their pictures and all their little elaborate things, Daddy, look, put it right on the wall, perfect, glue it on, it'll be there permanently. You can do that, all you need is a D29 license, which falls again under the C61. Now, suspense. Do you know how to keep someone in suspense? I'll show you, watch. Got it? Oh, wait, this is ceiling suspended, suspended ceilings. Well, the ceilings, you know, we don't want to keep them too much in suspense, but D50, that's what that's called. Again, it falls under the C61. Just a couple of things I want to show you here. Notice right here, yes, I know, I wrote it a little bit crooked, but that's okay. It says only have to pass the law. What does that mean? There is no trade manual or test that you have to take to get any of these. You only have to pass the law. They haven't written any trade material, so there's no state trade test for these D licenses. Again, there's a whole 15 more, and if you want to know which ones those are, you can go to our website, www.contractorlicensenow.com, or give us a call. We'll be able to share that with you. The beautiful thing is this. If you're already a licensed contractor, let's say you have a B license or a C6 or a C15 or a C27, and you want to add one of these licenses to it, well, you pay $75 and you apply. No other test has to be taken. Why? Because you're already a licensed contractor. And because you're already a licensed contractor, that means you already passed the law exam when you got your first license. So no test required. Now, for those of you who have not received a contractor's license, you will only have to pass your law. Now the great news is, is we are a school that has written our own law manual. So we're able to give you that at a reduced rate. So you wanna go check out our website. We have credible, we have really, really good law manual, law CDs, and law DVDs. They are enough to teach you and get you through. Now you can come in into our classrooms or find a class in a, in a city near you. Uh, or you can do our online classes where you just log on on your computer and you're there live with all the other students. You hear all the law teaching and um, you can go through that process. Or you could just buy our DVDs, CDs, and our law uh, manual. You're good to go. Go through that process. Once you're done and you felt like you've studied and you've passed all the tests that we send you up with or that we set you up with, then all you have to do, give us a call. We'll help you fill out the application even over, over the phone. We'll get that sent off and you can be a licensed contractor. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you. I look forward to hearing from you.